What's up, YouTube? Uh, it looks like the off-grid garage might be off to a fail before it even gets started. Um, so I was just uh, doing some wiring here. I was taking out this old wiring. I put some new stuff in. And uh, one of these things doesn't look like the other. This one looks good. This one looks good. This one looks good. Remember, these are 15-year-old panels. But, you know, they're all good. And then, of course, the last one, eh, not so good. Now, I haven't actually tested this yet. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and call that a failed panel. Um, even if it does still put out power, which, by the look of it, it doesn't. Uh, I don't know really what to do with it. Um, luckily this panel is warrantied for 25 years, it's a Kyocera 120, and, uh, they have been known to blow sometimes, and the warranty system's pretty good. Apparently, uh, I should be able to get a refurb and replacement for this. I haven't called them yet, but, uh, that's the plan. So I can have all four of these 120 watt panels instead of, uh, just three. I do have a 100 watt panel all the way over there in behind that ladder behind my junk um, that I may put in its place in the meantime just so I can get this project on the go because it'll probably take a little while to get a replacement for this but uh, yeah let this be a lesson to anybody that's got a solar panel set up you know inspect your uh, wiring and stuff every now and then I have no idea when this happened I mean you know like I said these panels are 15 years old um, 16 years old rather but I don't think it was too too long ago it's hard to say I mean you can see the corrosion and oxidization and soot <laughs> I don't know if that actually caught fire or just smoldered but uh, it, it's all heat distorted the, it's broken like the screws that were holding it because the plastic now all brittle from it getting too hot and you can see even the aluminum here for the LJ also got too hot and rusted so it's probably been a while these weren't completely weather tight I don't think that was really the problem but uh, now the one thing I'm going to have to do before I do set this up as well is I'm gonna to have to put these in the sunlight oh see there yeah Sun ow my eyeballs um, put them in the all in the Sun and see what happens because if these ones are low in produ production you know, they may, I mean, they may look fine up in here, but that doesn't mean that they're actually putting out what they should be. This actually makes sense because the last time I checked these panels last summer, before last, I think it was, uh, I couldn't get what should have been able to get out of them. I think they put out you know, seven amps each. Uh, so with the four of them, you know, I should have been able to get 21 amps and I was not getting that much at all. So, I don't know what the problem was there, but obviously, uh, it wasn't quite gotten it. Probably, again, this panel is probably just dead and not putting anything out. It may have been even sucking the system down. Who knows? I mean, you look, the you know, them diodes don't look like they're doing their job. So, uh, it is very possible that, that those diodes actually are dead. I don't know. I'll have to look at it, but... Uh, Anyways, I just thought I'd give you guys a, a quick little shot of that and uh, one of my first hurdles um, in building the solar panel garage or the off-grid garage. I don't know what I'm going to call it yet. You guys can uh, give me a name. You could tell me what to call it. But anyways, guys, I uh, hope you enjoyed the video as usual. If you like to, you know, like, comment, subscribe. Um, if you got anything, you know, you want to add about the solar panels or any, uh, personal experiences, whatever, uh, feel free to, you know, drop a line on the old comment section there because, you know, I only know so much about this stuff. I'm, you know, not an expert by any means. I know what I'm doing, well, at least enough to get me into trouble anyways, but, uh, always, you know, welcome others input, you know, and even cr cr constructive, cre creative I can't even think. Creative cr criticism. Or constructive criticism, yeah. It's still early in the morning. We had a poker game last night. Woo, poker. And uh, my head's still a little foggy. Had some wobbly pops, you know. So, that'll happen. Anyways, boys, till next time.
Talk to you later. Peace.